Alright guys, welcome back to another episode of Medieval Dynasty. So today we have a little bit of uh, bad weather. Uh, we'll probably um, see if we can. It'll make it a little bit more difficult to hunt that fox for sure. I wanted to hunt that fox down and complete that quest. Uh, oh, we actually have to hunt like three of them by the looks of it, not just one. So yeah, that's going to be a little bit of a challenge. Um, we got arrows, that's not an issue. So we'll grab these and then we'll grab the bow. We'll equip the bow. And I think, yeah, there's an arrow slot here. Nothing worse than getting ready to uh, attack something and not having any arrows ready. <laughs> Alright, so let's go into the woods. There is a couple foxes in here. I'm not sure how many, but we'll be able to maybe take on a couple of those. Just have to find them first, and the rain is making it a little bit more difficult than normal. So Yesterday would have been probably the ideal day. We'll just take it slow, and we'll see if we can't find it. I'm sure they'll be around here somewhere, so... Just a matter of finding them. Anyhow... Uh, when we do find them, it has to be a pretty precise shot uh, to take it out, but... see what we can do. I'm not sure what's up the hill. I know he was around here somewhere. And I don't think we have... No, we don't. We don't have the uh, heat thing yet for hunting. Let's see if we can't find them. Oh, there is some rocks around here too. Good to know. Oh, I heard them. It came from that way. Maybe down below. I, it's hard to hear. With all the rain. I'm just looking for him. I'm trying to find him. Did hear him though. Ah, oh, there he is. Okay, I need a precise shot. That's one.
Alrighty then, so I was just about to go into town, but then I realized that we might already have some of the seeds that we need in order to plant some of this stuff. Um, it says we need uh, car 15 carrot seeds, 15 wheat, 15 cabbage. We might have enough cabbage or not, I'm not sure yet. Uh, carrot, definitely don't have enough. Um, cabbage, almost. Beetroots. Did we need beetroots? No, we didn't. Okay, so beetroots are not on the list. I can put those back. We have three fertilizer. Uh, wheat. We don't actually have any wheat seeds. Uh, so, what are we looking at? Quite a bit. <laughs> Alright, let's just check how much coins. We have like 500 coins. So, might be able to get um, a few things. Uh, purchase some of that. Uh, we have all winter to complete this, so um, as long as we have money for taxes, and yes, there is taxes in this game, oddly enough. Uh, it tells us our tax amount. I forget where it tells us, actually. Journal? I have skills in diplomacy. I... Uh, diplomat... could use that one. Uh, I'm not actually sure where the taxes are located. I thought it was under... Oh, no, it's under here, I'm pretty sure. So taxes currently is 34.4 gold, so it's it's hardly anything at the moment. Um, as long as we have a little bit more than that, we should be able to be fine for spring next year, so... We just need to keep in mind that we do have taxes and stuff, but it shouldn't be anything to work towards that. Now, we need to find the farmer. Um, once I find the farmer, then we can start purchasing hey, some of the stuff. So, let's talk to How him. Are you? My wares never disappoint. Three, so we're going to need 15, right? So, we need 12 fertilizer. This is probably going to be the most expensive part. And that gives us 15 of that. Then we need carrot seeds. So four... So 11 carrot seeds. And we're down to like 300, so... Um, then we're going to need cabbage seeds. So we're going to need four of those. It should be somewhere around the top.
All right, so one of the things that we really actually desperately need is having a resource storage. So I've been starting working on that. Uh, this is going to take a little bit of time to build. Uh, we've got most of the walls and stuff up at the moment, but we still need to get the roofing and stuff like that. And uh, we might need some wood as well. Uh, I'm not sure what exactly, if we need planks or anything. I think this is a pretty early game thing, so we might just need logs. Yeah, we just need logs for that part. Uh, the roofs will need logs. And our hammer just broke. <laughs> Again. It's the second time I broke that hammer. Alright, but we are going to need some a bunch of other stuff as well. I'm going to put the sticks away. Uh, I harvested a little bit more sticks so we could get some of that done. Uh, basically what the resource storage will do is it'll take this stuff that um, people are crafting and stuff. And I'll put it into the resource storage rather than keep it at the local pile. Uh, if it overflows in the resource storage, then the local pile will be used. So basically that's how it works. Might need some of this for herself. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave her probably two in here. Just so she has something to work with. And then we're going to take these planks out as well. Uh, the, the firewood we could definitely take to the... Okay, we're going to have to leave the firewood here for a minute. <laughs> we're encumbered. Uh, yeah, we're still pretty slow. Okay, if we run kind of sideways, we run a little bit faster, but I just need to dump some of this stuff off. Um, but, yeah, the resource storage will be good because then everything will be more automated. So we can put that in here for him. And we can probably put the seven in here. Alright, if we need more wood, we can get it. Oh, we need a hammer too, that's right. And sticks. Let's uh, grab 10 sticks from here. And craft up a new hammer. I think I might have gone through all our other hammers, to be honest. I don't think I have any more left. No, I don't. Alright, so we just need to add some logs to here, and then I think it's uh, some straw, if I remember correctly. Yeah, straw. So... I think it's only like six um, parts to that. So one, two... There might be another one over here. Nope, maybe it's just five. Okay, maybe it's just five. Uh, let's grab uh, some of that straw now and then we'll start working on that. Uh, we can probably put rest the logs in here for him.
Alright, so we got, uh, the... I guess that's kind of like a storage house. It's also kind of very similar to a warehouse. So, we got that all settled. So, they'll be adding certain items to this one. Not so much food items, but any basic resource like logs, planks, bowls, things that are crafted. Um, tools. Tools are also added here. Animal products such as feathers, um, leather, things like that. Um, food has its own separate storage uh, system and that actually costs a lot of tax so we have to be really careful on how much um, more buildings that we build because we're going to need a lot more money and uh, we're going to have to do a lot more work for that. Uh, for food storage, uh, like it's very similar with how it's all linked up. Uh, basically what it would do is it would just basically um, everyone in the complex, so like the house here, uh, their house, not so much our house, but everyone else's, uh, will pull from the resource as well as the food storage. So uh, we don't necessarily, like if we go into this house at the moment, we have food and water in here. Um, those can be pulled directly from the uh, food storage and they basically just use it from that storage. They don't need to have it in their own house. So it, it makes it a lot more automated. Um, but uh, that's a problem for another day. Uh, I do need to go mining next episode and finish this house up here so we can get um, them a little bit more insulated. We might want to do the same for us, uh, but next focus is probably these guys here, uh, which will take a couple seasons, I think, to get all the limestone. But um, outside of that, if you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, comment down below, rate the video, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Peace out.